Good afternoon. I'm going to quickly show you how to transfer ownership of your Google Drive documents from one account to another account. Uh, so this is uh, really appropriate for students that are changing uh, from uh, the Oak Hills system into their own personal Gmail or um, for whatever reason you'd like to transfer your ownership to a personal account. So su super easy way to do this. You simply click on a folder you want to share. could be anything that you need to do. So I'm going to click on my uh, ISSN stuff. I'm going to right click like this and I'm going to hit share. And at this point, what I'm going to do is I'm going to share it with my personal uh, Gmail account. So I'm going to just start writing in my personal Gmail account. There it is. And I'm going to hit can edit and hit send. All right, that's step one. Step two, right click again, go back to share. And then Instead of that, you're going to click on that, and where it says can edit, you're going to hit is owner. That simple. You have everything shared into that Gmail account. So I hope that's really uh, helpful and, and uh, easy for you guys to transfer all of your documents out of uh, your school account into your personal account. For all of the random documents you do not have in folders, which uh, let's be honest, some of you may have never put things in folders, uh, it's pretty easy to kind of clear your stuff up. What I would do first is go ahead and create a new folder. So hit the plus, the uh, new folder button. Go ahead and title it whatever you want. If you want to put it, you know, OH, uh, sorry about that, try and type with one hand, OHHS. And um, you can call it whatever stuff or documents and hit create. And then all you have to do off on your left hand side, you may not have as many folders as me, uh, but OHHS stuff, what you're going to do is basically take everything that you want from your drive and put it in there. So you could, if you don't have any folders, simply select all. So I'm going to go ahead and select all. And then you simply would click drag all of this into OHHS stuff. And then you could simply share this folder with yourself like we've already done. So you'd go to the share and put in your personal email account, can edit, and then you'd come back in a second time and change the ownership. So again, I hope you guys have a great day and that works for you.